Up next, we have Lisa St. John, former private brand leader from Alibaba, believe it or not. If you didn't know Alibaba had a private brand, yes, in fact, they do. She's going to join us. Hello, everyone. Lisa, let me get your presentation up. Okay. Thank you, Grace. There we go. All right, Lisa, first of all, introduce yourself. So tell us who you are, what you do, and give us a little bit about you. Okay. The second slide is my introduction. Oh, perfect. I'll drop off and let you do that then. Yeah. Please let me introduce myself first. Okay. I was ex-managing director of private brand at Alibaba Group. That's called the Sun Art Group Group as well. Alibaba, I was I have about six years managing director role at Alibaba Sun Art Retail Group. My expertise in retail management and private brand strategy. And uh, also before joining Alibaba, I was senior director at Interbrand. I'm at Interbrand, I offered about brand and go-to-market strategy for 500 Fortune company. And also I lead the best global brand report project. Recently, I moved to United States and advised three AR startup company. And that's in startup company, my role is to advise their tech, how to leverage technology to do business applications and bring the technology to the business world. And also I advised the Web3 company in Silicon Valley that's helped me uh, digital world to do the consumer brand as well. That's all my introduction. Today, I'm going to talk about how to leverage a artificial intelligent technology to renovate it about in a private brand of retailer and from private brand to power powerhouse brands as well. Okay. But the challenge in the innovating private brands in American re grocery retailer is, firstly, let's talk about the raising of private brands. And because academic, the consumer, 40% of US consumers trained the new, they buy, I have confidence to buy the private brand. And the private brand is continue to getting popular because the, they have high available and low, lower price during the pandemic time. A successful private brand requires a well thought out strategy and operating model to maintain the brand relevant as well. And also, Running the private brand need a licensed strategy and also for the category execution as well. I think because the challenging in the maintain, maintain, maintaining, maintaining the brand relevant. So that's as how to leverage AR, AI technology can analyze its consumer trends to optimize the brand relevant and improve the consumer engagement because there are so many brands available and also how to stand out differentiation is very important for private brand as well and consumer demand for personalized products is have more demanding how to meet the this uniqueness if modern consumers how to they are interested about unique personalized product and private brands can how to meet this demand through the AR driven innovation. For example, AR can analyze consumer data to create a personalized product recommendation as well. And quality and quality and consumer trust is very important. How to leverage AR, AI to help ensure consistently quality and build up trust and loyalty as well. Okay, let's talk about some benefit and challenge and how to use AI to integrate 
and hyping for this area. Firstly, because integrate AI, AI integration can optimize the production and supply chain, leading to the higher profit margin and to the private branch. So that's the first uh, benefit we have. Secondly, because the tailored AI-driven marketing and personalized product recommendation can foster stronger customer loyalty as well, and thus improve the customer engagement rate. And competition with, with national brands, private brand face very a this competition from the well-established national brands in the market, how to make sure we can compete with national brands. And the consumer also have another challenge is because the, about the quality concern, how to leverage a, AR to make can serve this problem, have consume, uh, have, have, the, have the serve the quality control and customer confidence as well. And AR integrate another challenge is about AR can help in differentiation about private brands, enhancing customer perception and addressing competition as well. A strategic AR implication that is in, important to full benefit well in, integrate uh, the challenge for private brands. Also, balance innovation and the authenticity, finding the balance between the leverage AI for innovation well, maintaining the authenticity for private brands is key to success as well. Let's say, let's we go to see what is strategy for the private brand success. The first strategy is innovative product, pro, innovative product development. Implementing AR-driven market analysis to identify the gaps and trends, resulting unique and customer-centralized product and offer. Also about uh, brand positioning and differentiation, packaging design, leverage AI insights to craft compelling brand story, distinctive from competitors, uh, re resonating with target audience and personalized marketing and customer engagement. Use AI-powered customer data to deliver tailored marketing campaign, creating stronger brand and consumer connections. A dynamic price strategy is applying the AI to optimize price based on demand, competition, and the customer behave, enhancing the brand value and the perceptions. AI for efficient demand, inventory, and logistic management does to lead supply chain optimized. So let's talk about potential transformation of private brands, introduce AI for business innovation. Because the, recently their AI can use as your personal, their new technology helping the people can execute their task by AR agent. So that will lead a lot of new innovation, especially for private brand as well, because everybody talk about the old model and the new model. The traditional model is from product launching to different format, retail format, have different price, different format have different price, and go to see different people, looking for different people, then checking out the product. However, that's, there's new AI model is have driving the, we develop a product based on a group of target customer segment. And based on th this group of people lifestyle, we develop different product on the same group of people. And this group, we're driving about the product development innovation based on this group of people then going to checking out. That is a new model in terms compared with the old model. There's an example in US market that we call the we 
does retailer they specialize for launching for the Chinese retail group Chinese Chinese group of Chinese consumers, and then eventually they add to the Vietnamese, India, Spanish, a more group of people. They offer based on the people at the store. They offer the product in the same time doing the category management. So. So I think the very important role of private brand is to engage retailers, consumers' loyalty. Because the everybody talk about private brand, private brand is the soul of retailers, and pro, great inter private brands is cons consumer loyalty and the house power brands. There are three key driving force. The firstly always is price. The second is unique price, unique product, and the third one is very important. How to make private brand is in front of the mind of the people's mind. So as we are driving about product development through the target. Consumer segment. That's we need to changing as consumer when they think that product, our product, private brand, was front of their mind. Okay, generate gener gener uh, generative AI leads to private brand five point zero. Firstly, we use big data and the neurosciences. To identify the target consumer group, forecast the product feature, and price, demand, and revenue. Secondly, it forecast forecast future customer and reference behave and deploy broader and co-current multi-variate marketing action to adopt the challenge of marketing allergy, agility, and that's a productive. We call it productive. And then is about clarify the unique product ingredient and value proposition, craft the packaging, messaging, and contents that resonates with the target customers. Build target and personalized sales strategy that connect different customer segments, marketing channel, product category, and seasonal product objectives to improve GM way. And we are going to the lead us to go to argument it in the real time supplier and demand revenue forecast using the <coughs> VR and AR multi model media intelligent virtual agent as well integrate technology to up upgrade about online presence and tracking manufacture and quality control. Procedure as well. The、so、gen generative AI leads to private brand five five point zero. First one is product development. We put product date, product sales, category date, and consumer date, competitor date, and industry trend all together. That is we call the dynamic product and category management, and dynamic competitors, and omic channel. Dynamic consumer segment, all that will in our feature through the AI, and we use different prompting, prom prompt, and to driving about different kind group of segment, customer segment, in different kind group target segment, we have different interaction tag to engage with and develop our product development. So that's what we call the data driven through about data analysis and artificial intelligent technology, and give us the driving based on the all the data we put in and driving out to the product recommendation based on the different kind user group to develop a product recommendation system. Also, we use that technology to for the brand and the marketing strategy as well, and based on the trending content analysis for 
dynamic creative state and dynamic product date as well and the dynamic user segments and we put the feature uh, by the like social media uh, information and also our retailer brand official site features and searching in the banner and driving about different marketing and sales strategy and uh, that's we can use the chat gtp generate uh internal external information easily give you that recommendation for the brand and the marketing activity and also you can put about your guideline and the date driving integrate with chat gtp as well and in as internal use as well. And our solution is to use AI for, for boost every process with the composite AI solutions, improve the GMV through the unique visitor and times about CTI and integrate with CVR and AOV as well, especially use unique product recommendation system and the driving more um convert uh conversion rates and average order value with real time that's relevant to the recommendation for target customer segments and that's definitely improve the cvr and aov and the ctr we use the um that there's new ai technology called, called uh, rapidly builds uh, multiple iterations of product display and you different, they offer different brand image, product image and content based on different kind customer groups. Then give you dread, uh, they drive into the creative automations as well. And then we use that, then we used two kinds of AI. What is that I serve, they serve. AI, another called generative AI. They have different kind of AI and helping us improve the GMV through the unique visitor and the CTR, CVR, and AOV as well. Let me show you the details. And the, the AI driving product development is based on the through uh, that's revol rev revolutioning product development with AI. We use the AI driving idea to AI to driving date, driving some, give you some ideas about product recommendation and analyze market trend, consumer behave and competitors product to generate innovative product ideas. And through that idea, we apply the AI to rapidly create and integrate product portal type based on consumer feedback and market demand. And automatically they offer about product planning as well, implementing AR technology to optimize product schedules, inventory management, and also supply chain logistic for private brand product that's in the real time between the manufacturer and also retailers, consumers date and personalized marketing insights through the AI tool to, to driving personalized consumer insights and the enabling target market strategy for private brand products. And the successful story I can share with you one is from China. In US, we call the we call that company called the Timu. But in China we call the company as Pinduoduo. That successful story leverage AI technology in his innovative approach to e-commerce with focus in the social media and the value for money shopping. And by understanding the Chinese diverse consumer base, especially from the lower tier city with more limited income, uh, Pinduoduo managed to tailor its platform to meet the needs uh, of broader cities consumers the company effectively use ai in several key areas to support business model and driving growth so firstly for supply chain optimization by integrating ai into the supply chain management 
，拼多多 can， 呃，呃 ，product demand manage inventory more effectively and connect consumer directly with manufacturer. This reduces cost, allows for lower price, a、uh, lower product price, benefiting both consumer and suppliers. They are more successful in China and also. Very successful. Timo, Timo is successful in U.S. market as well. And logistic and delivery, they use AI delivery. They use AI technology are used to optimize the logistic and delivery rules in ensuring faster and more cost-effective deliveries. This is particular for the maintain the freshness of the agriculture product. Are significantly category on the Pinduoduo's platform. Quality control and counterfeit and detection AI and machine learning tools deployed to monitor and manage product list listings, helping to identify to remove the counter counterfeit or the is no not meet quality standard product. This is、uh, from Martin Trust. Ensure a big high quality shopping ex experience. So also, Pinduoduo、uh, use AI for the product recommendation and personalize as well. That is their their lot technology to analysis users' behavior, reference, and purchasing history to deliver the personal personalized product recommendation. This approach is not only enhance the shopping experience. For user, but also increase the platform overall commercial rate. There is very interesting insights from Pinduoduo is because in the past, all the AI for the e-commerce is focused today what you are looking, and tomorrow what you are looking, because what you are purchase, what you are looking or purchasing, and then they continue give your same recommendation for this product. And that's like a robot. The robot, if you put you use that technology, is will very narrow people you mind people's behave will getting sick about that in the future. However, the new AI technology will use neurosciences will helping you is you know when you get that the AI feel and touching your emotion. That in your emotion and leverage with another people's emotion as like people's neural, uh, in the mind, and that will give you the new, the anticipate the new media, uh, hot pop, uh, uh, trend, and also the new trend of customer behave, customer motivation, customer want which kind product. It will be fashion. Will they are what they are looking for? That is AI new technology they use, and they also use the robot as customer service, as well. So the Pinduoduo currently their market market is already stock market price is almost is similar like Alibaba market. Stock market price now. It's Alibaba. We have a new product innovation center, C T M I C, that's helping use AI technology claims new product success rate. It's over about seven seven percent, significantly higher than the industry form, where particular only five percent of new product succeed when they launch a new product. This achievement helping Alibaba effectively in identify a neutral potential best sellers within the competitive market, and also for the new production, new production, new product development as well. I use this tech technology and lead this project to helping new product launching. It's getting really successful and also getting. Really, a powerful impact to target customers, boosting profits with AI because maximizing margin through the AI driving strategy can 
op optimizing price, inventory, and the personalized promotion, leading to increased margin and profitable for private brands. The case study showed us about 15% profits uplift through the AI-powered price strategy and leveraging the consumer engagement through the AI, empowering, empowering empowering consumer loyalty within AI innovation can boost repeat purchasing price and brand loyalty. For instance, personalized recommendation increase, customer engagement rate was increased as well. And the increase about conversion rate and AOI with AI, and we optimize conversion rate with AI have different focus on different strategy and personalized marketing, target target uh, promotions, use AI tools, and conversion rate optimized strategy leverage, leverage AI and technology to getting SEO, SEO, continue optimize conversion rate process, and refining product recommendation and user experience, checking out flawed increased conversion rate for private brands. So the AI benefit for private brands is the firstly reduce the price and improve increase about GMV and use AI can increase about 25% GMV, 11% uh, 11, 11 CTI, C, CTR, 10% CVR and 2% AOVs and reduce about 15 to 50, 15 to 50% cost through the AI compared with competitors. Also engaged customer engagement rate increase about 10 to 15%. User sessions about increase about 15 to 30%. We also improve about efficiency of product development and leading time three times faster than before. Thus, we use AR, we getting that benefit. The takeaway is how to use AI users tools, create your own GTP for product innovation and content strategy, packaging design ideas and design. For example, you can open your own open AI, G, uh, uh, open AI account and you trained your own, oh, Open AI account and uh, pro prompting uh, the key message. Use the category management logic set to guide your own GTP and give you driving for your own uh, GTP analysis based on your product innovation. They give you different kind pro private brand recommendation and some ideas helping you driving the content strategy as well, packaging ideas, and uh, maximum about content SEO and driving searching traffic from out with about out rankings. Can okay, use different kind, use, use GTP with bus AI, uh, can give integrate about find out, find your product uh, right, uh, content SEO, putting the package and the content as well. And the data sciences for all, you can use uh, chat GTP. They have the sub app. So, uh, they have the GTP have, have analysis, data analysis tools as well. You can use to analysis about your insights, customer behave, and also give you some ideas how to lead to your, which part, give you advanced analysis as well. And from also from the strategy, they also can help you doing the creation for the flexible video with Pika and also test to the image. Recently, uh, GPT launching about new test to image and video as well. That's very powerful. So how to leverage about use the uh, AR tools for marketer, for the product recommendation, and also for creation designer and 
you should find your own AI tools integrate your daily jobs. Okay, that's all the presentation for today.